Hello, my name is Christian Klein. I'm Managing Director of Control Lab Products and I want to show you some exciting stuff that we have created using this remote operator terminal which is uh, connected through a wireless connection with a CAM bus and we have coupled that to a simulation model. Right here you see the simulation model running already. It's a simulation of a ship uh, with a knuckle boom crane and the ship is floating on the sea on waves and at the left you see an image, a 3D visualization of the seabed. We are going to hoist a rover, a remotely operated vehicle and put it into the sea with this crane and almost at the complete left you see a graph indicating the position of the rover. Well, running this simulation is very simple because I can use the uh, remote operator terminal to hoist the load. And now move the crane with two other joysticks. It's now on position and I'm going to extend it a little bit. And now it's ready to launch. We are going to lower it into the sea. And as you will see on the left image, there's the rover coming, going down to the sea floor. And because of the movement of the ship, you will see it going up and down. Well, with simulations of ship cranes like this, we can design controllers that can uh, compensate the effect of moving ships and do all kinds of exciting stuff and simulate it before these cranes are actually built. It's useful for cranes and all kinds of equipment and uh, we can even extend this technology to do a real hardware in the loop simulation where the controller is running on a PLC and the virtual ship on a PC where we couple both to run a hill simulation and we can even extend it to a full training simulator to train operators how to handle this equipment. I think that's exciting stuff and we will tell you all about it in the next newsletter.